afternoon, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 2 p.m. update. And we have a bit of a mixed bag out here. That mix goes like this. The Dow's off 30 points. The S&P's down 6. NASDAQ 100 is off 18. The Russell's up 9. Semis are off 6. Trannies are up 163. Truly a mixed bag out there. You've got gold trading out at 1707. That's up 4 bucks. Silver trading up 17 cents at 1877. Lights recruit up $4.11. She's trading at 101.67. Natural gas up 45 cents. Today is bar number 8 of a TD9 count. Says we should see a top form between today and Wednesday inside of natural gas. 30 year treasuries down one point, trading out at 139.02 out there. Uh, let's go spend a little time, take a look at our cash indice charts out here. We'll switch over to those screens and momentarily you'll see the Dow in the upper left hand corner. What's the Dow telling us? The Dow is showing us that price has got back into a prior swing point. That prior swing point was from the date of June 28th out there. Uh, if we do get a uh, significant pullback, I'd be looking at 37.48 as the uh, target. The S&P 500, that doesn't look right. 38.63, that is definitely not right. That is Friday's data. Oh, Stevie's got some work to do here. There's something wrong with my S&P chart. So we won't go there. The NDX 100 chart, that looks to be correct. We're at 12. It is not correct. Uh, I don't have my data feed going here. This is a bummer. All right. So we're going to skip that. Uh, Stevie will figure, figure out that uh, technical detail, uh, but I'm not going to do it while I'm on the air with you. Instead, we're going to go switch over to my other nine panel market update chart. So let's go do that here. Let's go take a look at this. That way, at least I'm providing you with some decent information out here. You can see the ES Mini running right into resistance at the bottom of its weekly profile. It's at 3887. Support may be 3842. Spot volatility is still below. It's 50 day exponential moving average. And um, that's a, uh, you know, a bullish directional signal for the S&P 500. The NASDAQ, the NQ, has run right into resistance. That's at the 12,197 level. Price got up to the 12,186 12, area. 12,197.05 is a key resistance level. The U.S. dollar index did form a top on Friday, but it also formed a brand new bullish structured Profile with support in the 106.43 to 106.73 level. If gold closed below 17.04.50, it will have failed to maintain its buy the D point pattern out there. Lights recruit. Looks like it wants to take a ride on the reading. That reading ought to take it up to the 105.24 level. Folks, stay tuned. Your favorite polar bear, David White's up next. I'll see you tomorrow on Terrific Tuesday, 1 o'clock, sir. Have a magnificent Monday, folks. <laughs>